Sending this left jab out, it's an A to B punch from your chin to your partner's chin and back as fast as possible. So the boxer's turning his fist into this punch, turn the shoulder into it, coming back speed, very important. Whatever you do, don't lean in with this shot. Keep your body straight and tight, keep your right hand in front of your face as a defence. Working a double jab now, again keeping that right hand in front catch your partner's jab or catch your partner's cross if you're trying to counter-attack your shot. Snap it out, ensuring you're not leaning forward. Whatever you do, don't lock your elbows out on these shots. There we go, full speed, double jab. That's fast hands. There we go, jab cross. Flick that jab out and then turn that body into that right cross and then snap it back. Don't lean in, breathing out, exhaling both, both punches. Double jab cross. Double jab cross, good setup combination, good finishing combination. Feels nice to throw a double jab cross. It's one of the easiest combinations to learn. Put more power into these punches, you sit down a little bit further, and make sure you turn your knee, your hip, and your back into these shots without leaning into them. You've got to stay straight. Jab cross jab, a long punch combination, good setup combination. Nice to put a left hook in after this combination or a right hook. Double jab, cross jab, again another long combination. Excellent for getting your man on the ropes. Double jab, cross jab, and look for an angle shot, stepping in with an uppercut or a hook off either hand. It right cross on its own, keep your hand near your chin, bending your knees, lift your heel up, turn your right knee, turn your hip, turn your back, finishing your power into your punch. Put some weight onto your legs, bend them knees, put weight onto your knees, you get more power into your end of your punch. Again, you can't go leaning in on these shots, if you're leaning on these shots, you're going to get countered with uppercuts or hooks. Left hook, rotating your body one way and then pulling your shoulder back to develop power into the hook. Dip your right knee, dip your right shoulder, pull your right shoulder back to develop power into your left hook. Excellent close quarter punch. Cross hook, again good finishing move, turn your shoulder all the way into it and then pull that shoulder back, finish power into left hook, turn your body one way, turn the body the other, switching your weight, trying to keep your eyes focused forward, make sure there's lots of power. There we go right uppercut. The rudder boxer's got right uppercut here, 
dipping down, bending his knees, turning that right knee, turning that right hip, turning that right shoulder through, finishing off on knuckles. Keep your elbow close into you. Sets up left hook beautifully. You see that left uppercut? Turn your right knee in and left forward. Possibly the most unused punch in boxing left uppercut. You're leaving yourself open for a right hook, right cross if you're dipping down, dropping this left hand. It's got to be timed beautifully.